now and I'm eight years old. I stay here in Tanun with my mom. I have three brothers and two sisters. This is the street where I live. Monday to Friday, I go to school. I'm happy to go to school because some of my friends can't go. I walk to get to school, but I never would walk by myself. Most of the time, I try to walk with my brothers. Janoon is one of Cape Town's informal settlements situated east of Table View. And like most panoramic views of Table Mountain, this one comes from a place of pain, not beauty. Crime, poverty, unemployment and disease plague the everyday lives of Janoon residents. Many are seeking for a better life, but the majority find no such option. The crime affects everyone. School is a safe place but getting here is sometimes a challenge. Here are my school friends, and it's good to see them again. Lot of the children we are dealing with are very weak in books. They, they, they do not progress. Their parents are not educated. Then it's not easy for them to, to, to help their children in homeworks and other schoolworks. A woman who is trying to make a difference in the lives of the children of Danoon is Mary Mitting from the Boost Africa Foundation. I came to South Africa in 2001 and I came and I was amazed at the country. For the most part it was a first world country and yet I was alarmed that it was also a third world country. The vision of Boost Africa is to make sure that each child has the opportunity to go to school. The Keep a Child in School program is the initial program that we started with. We provide a school uniform for the child, we provide a food parcel for the family, a stationery for the child to go to school. We provide basically what they need in their time of need. Boost Africa is currently supporting over 100 children in the Keep a Child in School program. These are children living in the noon who have been affected by crime, drugs and the HIV crisis. I'm from Eastern Cape and my mom, is, she is sick. And I don't, I don't know my father, I don't have my father. And I come here in Cape Town to my uncle. But my uncle didn't care about me. He boost Africa, played a big role in life. He helped me for the school uniforms and then for keeping the, the food that I get it from the boost Africa. On Tuesdays and Thursday, I go home to change. And then I go to see Mary and Yoyo, who lead the kids club. They give us games and pictures to color. Boost Kids Club, also known as the BKK, is a program meant for scholars from the primary school to high school. 150 kids come to join us Tuesdays and Thursday, where we provide them with activities such as numeracy, literacy, and arts. And then after that, we just give them a sandwich and a juice to eat. This is my drawing. I'll keep it to show my mom. She'll be expecting me home soon. West Africa helped me give child uniform and stationery and food when me I have no work. I think Mary helped me to go go up and up to the university. I'm very happy for Post Africa helping me with my family. Currently we're working in Danoon and Joslovo, but it's certainly not the vision. The future is to go into every city and every rural area in South Africa to make sure that children get a chance to go to school and to have a hope and a future. Barney, I want to be a social worker.